we are going to make fingerprint bugs. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to make a jar. Make one long line on one side of your paper. Make another long line on the other side of your paper. Connect at the bottom with something that looks like a smile. At the top, draw something that looks kind of like a hamburger or a squished cookie. I can make the edge or the neck of my jar look however I want. I can draw another smile underneath and I can put some little lines inside that make it look like that's how the lid stays on before I take it off and let them all go, of course. Now we're going to print some bugs on with some paint and our fingertips. I need paint. I need a shallow pan of water. I need some paper towels to wipe my fingers between colors. I'm going to wet my finger and I'm going to put it in one of the paints and print it. Do you notice that I'm just pressing down? I'm not dragging my finger. So we're not going to draw with the paint. We're going to print with it. Hmm, my finger's clean. I'm going to go into the yellow and press. If I press my fingerprints two or three in a row, it starts to look like a caterpillar. My fingers are dirty. I'm going to clean them between colors or else I wreck the colors of the paint. Nice clean finger in the orange. Two wide prints and two tiny prints underneath look like a butterfly. Wide, wide, tiny, tiny. Big, big, tiny, tiny. Notice how well I clean off my finger between colors. I don't want to get colors mixed up in my painting set. I can use a pinky and do a lot of little prints in a row to make a worm or a caterpillar. Again, do you notice that I am not putting my finger on the paper and dragging it? I am just touching the paper. I have a clean finger with red. I'm going to do some ladybugs. And I'm using my finger kind of flat, so I'm making an even bigger print. I think I have enough prints now to do some details. I want to make some antenna for my bugs. Maybe some of my bugs need legs. You can have fun turning your bugs into whatever you'd like them to be. My black crayon is really helping me with my details. And there I have a jar of beautiful bugs. You can sneak a little back upside down smile if you want.